Good morning, Knights. Let me begin by congratulating you on three weeks of classes. This has been completely new for all of us uh, to learn whether we're learning virtually, teaching uh, virtually and in the classroom, or learning to do things in a, a socially distanced way. What I want to say is we are so proud of you for these first three, we three weeks, but I also want to make you aware that if you're struggling in any way with your faith, with anxiety, with relationships, or with academics, we're here to help. So I'm going to briefly go over our academic probation. And the real goal about our, of our probation program is to get you help as quickly as possible um, so that if you have tripped over a hurdle at this point in the year, we get you back on track uh, for the rest of the year. Um, so without further ado, let me share my screen. And here we go. So our whole goal here is to give, to give you uh, as much support as we can. So each week for our academic probation that begins this week, we run our grades for every student. For most students, for most students, you're academically clear. You've learned how to handle this kind of new way of learning. You've gotten your homework in. Um, and you know, at this point in the year, your grades probably show more about homework rather than much of anything else at this point if you haven't had your first major test or paper. We know that those are coming up, so we are uh, kind of launching tutorials. I will follow up this uh, video with an email with those tutorial schedules, so you'll know exactly who to seek for help, where to go get help, and when that help is available. But most of you will be academically clear, and we're really proud of you if, if that's the case. You're academically clear, and we won't necessarily be reaching out at least initially to you if you're passing all your classes or if you have only 1D. But what we, I want to tell you is that just because you are passing your classes doesn't mean that we aren't here to help you. So please reach out to the counselors, reach out to a teacher, reach out to myself, reach out to any trusted adult if you're struggling academically or with anything else in your life, because we know that these are unprecedented, challenging times. Some of you have hit that first hurdle. Right, so uh, what is added here is it used to be if you had grades, two grades below a 70, you automatically lost your eligibility. But we wanna make sure, because this is so new, that we get you support before you face major consequences. So let's pretend you have one F, or you have two or three Ds, or one F and two Ds. At that point, we're really kind of concerned and we really just wanna get you back on track. So you're gonna be placed on an academic concern list. Someone will be reaching out to you to see uh, how we can help you. Somebody will be reaching out to your family, but our real goal here is to assess if, if there's challenges and intervene early. You can be on this list for two weeks uh, in a row or three weeks across the semester. But if we see much more than that, our concern is that there's habits that we need to work on and habits that we need to shift. So that brings us to academic probation. And at this point, you still are eligible. You'll be, we're gonna create an individualized contract with you. We're gonna have strategies for how you're gonna work at home, how you're gonna balance out your work, but basically you're gonna kind of create with a counselor a contract um, that is gonna include things like you're gonna to go to specific tutorials at specific times. You're gonna to agree to get your work in. You might have back work that you need to complete and we'll figure out kind of a support system for you. So regular check-ins with people. This lasts for four weeks, uh, kind of no matter what. And if you re meet your terms of your contract, we believe that your grades are gonna go up, you're gonna build stronger relationships, you're gonna get the help you need, um, but you will stay eligible for that play practice or for that sports practice that is so motivating to you. If, after the, if however, you have two Fs or four more Ds or you haven't met the terms of your uh, academic contract, at that point, you'll become ineligible. And we really need you to focus on academics first so there aren't long-term consequences uh, to kind of falling down the hole. So we're gonna get you that help. You're gonna be in daily tutorials. Uh, you will at this point be ineligible for practices, for games, for, for performances, because for two weeks, we need you to focus uh, kind of full tilt on your academics. Hopefully at this point, you're bringing up your grades. And so we'll be able to offer you probation or even more ideally, you're clear. I also want you to know that each week uh, there's a student support team that meets and this team is not just to help with academics, it's holistically to support you. So there are kind of our counseling team, our student support coordinator and school counselors who are going to be there to help uh, coordinate and manage plans for everything related to anxiety, to struggles with faith, to academic struggles, to struggles at home, to struggles with your relationships or just you need, feel like you need additional support. So we have our student support coordinator as part of this team. Our school counselors are, are part of this team. We have members from campus ministry, from admissions, from athletics, from our night success program and from academics. 
And so what I want you to hear today is we're really proud of you for these first three weeks. But if we can help you in any way to be more successful for the rest of the year, we want you to reach out to us. We have a coordinated team that mirrors our holistic education and we're here to help. So please reach out. I will email this link below or just come speak to any trusted adult because we want to get you the help you need. So good luck and go Knights.